it worked very nicely. And uh, for the, w Diane helped start the agency, get it started, and then became a. a, a well, I went home to take care of Bo. A mother to take <laughs> care of Bo and and our and our daughter, and uh, and our great Dane, <laughs> and. Uh, so she didn't. She then came back to the agency after about about six years. Well, Wendy was years. five, so it was about it was about eight years. Yeah. Um, I mean, I would come in and help out occasionally, but you know, my first we were first duty at that point was to take care of the kids, and yeah. when they were both in school, I I came back to help out. We lost a receptionist, and I came back to help out and. And back in those days, PR was really in its infancy in, uh, in Phoenix. There were a couple of PR professionals, but no agencies had no agency public had a relations PR department, department at that time. So. And I wasn't trained. I mean, I was, I was an English major, but I had... You could spell. I could you spell. Could <laughs> My grammar was fine. <laughs> and I had, had, had a lot of uh, public management and public relations kind of training when I was in college. I'd been given a, a rather significant assignment that really molded my future. When I look back on it, that was the turning point. But So I gradually picked up, uh, take, would take care of PR for our client and eventually started picking up my own business and, and uh, we grew it. Um, it's fun. We had a great time with E.B. Lane. He did the advertising, I did the PR, and sometimes we didn't see each other for days in the office. I mean, we, you know, we, we had different disciplines, which worked well for... for yeah, that our, did work you know, well. I, I don't know how it would work if you were trying to compete with each other. Yeah. Who could get the biggest account yeah. or something. So, know, so we were each other's advisors. You know, I would come in and say, well, you know, we'd talk over a PR account or he'd show me something, but we, we could advise. But there was always the person who was in charge of that department, and, and I think that that was part of the success. And the other part of the success of us working together is that we determined right from the beginning there was one boss, it was him. Uh, you know, so I stayed out of management decisions, and you know, I didn't just sort of, I was an employee of the agency rather than a boss, which I think you have to do. Otherwise, otherwise you, they can you know, divide and conquer, <laughs> and you can make a big mess. You can so so that was an important decision early on when I came back into the agency.